for the first time. Hey, oh God, don't cap my leg. Hello, everyone. Good evening, good morning, good afternoon, wherever you are. My name is Anne, and I welcome all of you back to NHTV. If you're just joining us for the first time, please don't forget to like and follow us on our Facebook page and also subscribe to our YouTube channel. Yes, and we today we are in our Amebo corner. Mm, today in Amebo, now we will do today and uh, our pigeon for our pigeon people. And to those of you who know to understand the baby grammar, I'm mm, not so good. They do for pity for now. Yes, today, hmm, one more. Now, see, hmm, sister, don't swallow for you. I beg, I just ask him. I want to. This is how I see you do most. So, now, so the guy answer, oh, more. Hey, hey, the man fine. No, no, be small. Oh. In short, we'll come to that. <laughs> sister, Tom, well done. Welcome to the show. And eh, all of now, now, no waiting. They happen for. Mm, for our country, all the wahala way, the way they happen, the killing, them talk, the no talk, and everything. Eh, sister, I did come not decide. Say, you know what in them? The CP way, sister Kemi say she don't contact to arrest me to do it. Waiting, we we go gukuma go meet them for office. Make we go pour our mind for uh, our commissioner of police mm. and then no be only she waka go deal now she and um sylvester uh auntie nine follow go the office and cp don't talk they talk when the man they even they talk so I just they lose so, so that this so this man even fine eh hey no be smart anyway so i'll be like say police i go join police work eh, see while i'm gonna just listen to eh, our sister as she did eh, narrate the story with our cp then we'll come back Matter. Hello Nigerians, guess where I am? Okay, so everybody should go and relax. I'm bringing you updates from the top authority. And guess who I have here? Hey, so the Commissioner of Police, Lagos State, Sipi Odumosu. So please help us tell everybody something. Oh, that's it, you should leave. You don't want to in this video. So concerning Sylvester's case, we've had a meeting with him, and he has assured us that. All hands are on deck and they are doing everything humanly possible to ensure that justice and nothing but justice is served. All investigations are on. All the boys are in his custody, the house master, everybody needed. Nobody should help us to look for anybody again. The CP said, in fact, he's going to tell himself. Hey, now. Nigerians are seeing you smile for the first time. Hey. Oh, God, don't cap my leg. Fellow Nigerians. We appreciate your patience, we appreciate your understanding, but it's not yet over until it's over. So I just want to assure members of the public, including the members, the family and the school authority, that uh, the police is doing everything. So uh, the police is doing everything within the base of the law. So to unravel the circumstances that led to the death of the young child. So even the death, we still appreciate him. And the family members now that have been cooperating with us, she won that for that month. So the autopsy has just been carried out. So that is the scientific one. And the autopsy was not carried out alone by any party. I said earlier, there are four interested parties grouped to this. The school authority on one part, the interested party. The family of the deceased, second one. And the family of those that are alleged to have committed the acts. The children of alleged who are in our custody now, who are in juvenile detention, because for their own fundamental rights, we don't keep them with adults. Those that we detain properly in the adult institution are the house masters. So the four groups now, and the government on the other part, the government, the family of the deceased, so the family, the of the accused person, and the school authority. So we held a meeting separately on that. In the conference room, interactive room with everybody, with their lawyers. And the postmaster was just carried out yesterday. And the experts of the government, so the cause was brought to Lagos by a, a qualified funeral organization. And the cause has been returned now to the town for the period, so that the agony of the parents now will reduce. And every member now have participated, that is, the representative of all four of the groups, their own medical personnel, all participated in the postmortem to make it free 
fair and to make this journey one. So I want everybody, I understand your passion, I understand your feeling as a mother, as a brother, as a sister, you know what you're going through, but don't let us tell you all to our hands. Just relax. I'm confident that we are doing it. I wish I do it. Justice has begun. Thank you so much. So forget much. and suspend comments that are inflammatory. Somebody went on social media and said, so the suspect or the victim drank, so engine oil. Where is the IT proof? Which laboratory that tested that? Let us do the patient and await the result of the autopsy. If it is true, engineer was drunk, autopsy will prove it. So let us just have confidence in that. And some agitating, let the school not be attacked. Because race is a collective word. Say, what do you go upon that the school? Don't do that, please. It's an appeal for that to be another offense to be committed. Innocent lives could be lost in the process of burning the school down. Somebody running into that fire going on. And the adjoining buildings, the fire can extend to adjoining buildings. Who knows the adjoining buildings that are residential? Older people, sick people are there. Who knows that people that are having asthma are there? And the smoke, they could hear it and death could occur. So it should, not, it should please allow the government to do its job. We are not sleeping at all. Mm -hmm. I shall not sleep on the justice yes, is sir. done. So I appreciate Thank you, everybody. We we'll remain loyal to bringing togetherness in Nigeria and we'll continue to ensure that peace and nothing but peace. This is democracy, and the government has promised us that they will continue to be open. So let everybody go and keep their minds at rest. We're on top of it. No protests, no gathering for now. Let the family mourn. We are also mourning as parents. And let everybody relax. And thank you to the Commissioner of Police. Thank you for giving us the opportunity to, to be with you tonight. I've been here for four hours, though. You know, easy. Oh. Ah, so you see, see, you know, easy. Oh. Not commit crime, oh. <laughs> you go first step for the detain you. <laughs> so see, our CP is laughing. Nobody has seen you smile. So look at Sly's auntie is here as well. It's not showing you, it's showing you. Sly's auntie is here as well. So thank you, everybody. Let's wait for the um, official report from the autopsy and we hope that justice and nothing but justice will be served. Peace out. Uh, my people are welcome on our back. Uh, I do well. Thank you. Me don't forget to help us share and subscribe to this channel. Thank you. And um, I don't hear from our CP um, with that. He don't come out, can't talk. He don't talk, say, because, you know, speculations, people, they talk plenty of things, eh, eh, this one, the boy, some travel, blah, 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 well, we don't know, verify, but now, don't hear from the horse's mouth, as we go, they talk. He don't come out, can't talk, say, all the boys, where they involved for the matter, eh, say they don't, they under their custody, eh, and they don't take them, go eh, juvenile detention. Juvenile detention, now, nah, mm, place, eh, where youth, eh, then they put, you know, teenagers, is a or you go they call them they say youth detention center now it be uh, because enough you mix them with uh you know the bone bone reggae people <laughs> you know they don't come bad past uh the one with them they so because then they try won't correct them and he also make uh, one comment they say some people they talk say the boy drink uh, engine or he do this and i know the person we're talking now uh, sister our um investigative journalist we come up on top, say, sister, can we say the boy drink engine oil and everything? And this time, my task was she don't talk, and then uh, the CP make notes of her. Me, I for say, make the invite her, make she come, you know, come at least come prove and come tell us who tell her how she used to get her uh, information because uh, you know, good make we carry the talk matter with person. No, no, this period, the family they try mourn their picking, so we make we know begin they add more to the family. Wahala, we're already day ground. You understand? So now I just believe, say, uh, make everybody just relax. Give the family the opportunity to mourn their picking because as soon as here, so they don't even release uh, the body of uh, Sylvester for the family to go bury. And uh, the family don't go bury their picking. So me go just say, make everybody just rest their matter. Uh, I want sorrow, sorrow. Auntie Toku Toku, uh, you see, say, commissioner, don't come talk. And you don't come and sit up. However, hmm? Then say after commissioner released this statement to give grant uh, this interview, short interview to uh, Sister Dayton. So nine you know, say I want to investigative journalist. Nine go out, come out, come 
make her own uh, statement. I go read them for now. And if now once see them, I go tell on her page where yeah, they make it be like say uh, now we they can't talk. It let's say as commissioner talk, do this interview finish. You know, tonight she post this one, they can't still repost them after some few hours again. I don't understand what this woman mean. And uh, this one, she they come challenge uh, the you know, know the um lawyer Falano. They she they always carry a femi Falano, she they carry the man matter. For head uh, according to statement by Dr. Kemi Oluloyo, I go read that for Oyibo language as a writer, and uh, where she released 8 45 p.m. and uh, that was on the 16th of December 2021. And uh, she writes, She said, Femi Falano is an overrated son who feels he's above the law, he carries a dangerous ego which he feels he can use to intimidate the government and protect the people. Um, I'm planning to sue him for dragging my professional reputation, asking police to invite me for specifically my recklessness, recklessness statement concerning Sylvester Orumone, a fake petition we are yet to see. Re reckless what? He wants to use he wants to use scare tactics. He uses with sensitive governments. If in fact he's filing on behalf of the Oru Money family, I will be suing them too for damages. She said, if in the uh, file the case on behalf of uh, Sylvester family, say she said go sue uh, Sylvester family for uh, damages for this kind. I mean, all this wahala we don't need them. This people, like, this family, are going through a lot, so we don't need all this anti chemi the Orumani family should fire him and use their senses. Falano is a distractive. Sorry, Falano is a distraction and one who loves media trials. He is not focused and doesn't care about civil, civil, legal, and human rights of anyone. Just act like he does. No family of a dead schoolboy should drag an investigative journalist. <laughs> She don't say no family of a dead schoolboy gets the right to drag a uh, investigative journalist like herself. Now, hmm. oh, wow, Auntie Kemi, pity the dead boy now and the family. Then she continues. She said, "The era of those who spoil my name in this country, Nigeria, will end soon. I know my legal rights. I have information that could make or break this case, designed to ruin the reputation of so many." others that one go they interested though because she said she gets information Ogun get gist typical one top secret where she gets under her hand when you say she feel used to destroy a lot of people for this matter so then she continues she said nigerians have their mob mentality and uh, like uh anyhow anyhow now see five percent if my give you group group but i can put tire for your neck and I saw she say the mentality where she get. You know, say she be Canadian. Mm, no wahala. I'm black and proud. And she continues. She said, Falano, investi Falano, investigate the children police have in custody. One of them is holding a document that Sylvester consented to, and his family are well aware. He said, Me Falano, uh, in interrogate uh, those boys where they police custody. He say one of them get top secret information where she said no about. Where uh, Sylvester family says no, and see plenty talk. Okay, anyway, she can't continue. She said the Oru the Oru family should undergo a lie detector test. I don't know. We we'll get her for Nigeria. Uh, that would be very interesting. <laughs> very interesting, you know. Yeah, for like uh, see that kind of one. You know? mm. As well as the staff in custody, they have a lot of info. The dying child shared with them. They did not post on social media. Um, and then she continues. She said, I'm an award-winning investigative journalist of 20 to, of 27 years, not an internet blogger and social media personality in the capacity. She said she no be blogger or oh, this too much talk talk way some people they do for internet. Say so she get 25 years investigative journalist uh, with all the degree from uh, uh, um, Canada. Mm. Anyway, she can't continue. She said, any journalist can open any case at any time. We are journalists. We know our mission. We will not be intimidated. And the and that applies to you, Mr. Falano, 
all the non-entity celebrities and their fans sending me violent threats. She say uh, the non-entity celebrities and uh, their fans where they send her uh, violent uh, uh, threats and um, Ikari Falan or join them. Then the lies in Nigeria is way too much. Nobody can suppress the truth. And the truth is, Kenny Ululoyo. Then she can continue. Merry Christmas to all. Hashtag Truth Wins 2022. Dr. Kemi Ululoyo, journalist. <laughs> hey! Mahala oh, day. Auntie Kemi, I just go beg you, leave this family to rest. The CP Odumoso has come out to grant a short interview. And he said everybody should just step back and let them do their job. They don't set four groups of panels. We go investigate this matter. So let this family mourn. The, the body of the uh, of the dead of uh, Sylvester has been released to the family, and they've traveled to go bury this boy. So let this family rest. I beg. That's what the other day I bumped into a post some days ago, because uh, one sister that way they had to come out. And when she hear as a mother begin blast, you know she just she lost her son. So the only picture she gets, so she can feel that pain. She can you know that kind of thing. She know as it be for body. She come out tell and say, and say, leave this talk. You they talk like that so we no get help, we no get brain. You understand? If you don't take time, say I go beat you. She said they among the people won't beat her. And I see talk and see make you leave her. Then I can see post where uh, uh, this is Dr. Kemi Conrad. She's uh, she say, um, say she say make Ada go go celebrate the death of her child. You can imagine picking where don't die when. Say I saw a post some days ago where Kemi said to Auntie Ada. To go and celebrate a dead child and say this is too bad too too bad it's too bad you don't need all these ones so please please respect your age respect your investigative journalist respect your 27 years of journalism respect your canadian certificate respect the whatever you're carrying your in cid and you did everything that you know too much and just let this family be at peace let them be at peace among their son no parents is happy about this. And the CP has spoken. So please, let's don't turn this to be fracas or maybe because you have your bias about one person or you've got one person in mind, you will come decide, say, now opportunity will be this. Don't forget, say, now family, some families, now they involved them, they in pain. They're going through a lot. So now the gist, my people, I say, make I just come drop for now, uh, this evening. So I beg, make we not follow, tell this our auntie, say, make she step down, make she leave Mata for Matthias. Enough is enough. The one which you don't do, don't you, you don't do this one. And people don't die, children don't begin die. Family, they mourn this time period. Few days before in bed, they nine, then kill them. You understand? Now, Christmas be this families we spent Christmas together. This one in no go there around, you know. So you can imagine what's in, in, in family, then go they go through that one alone. So please, Auntie Kemi, drop this case. The commission of police have. I've said it. Please drop it. Everybody should just lie low and wait. Let them do their job. So my people, please, I say thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Please help us to like and also share. Drop your comments at the comment section, whatever you feel, you know, regarding this issue because it's, I mean, it's, 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 it's uncalled for. It's, it's not proper. And also, don't forget to subscribe to our channel, our YouTube channel. So I come your way again, Nami and our girl, and make gonna take care and have a lovely, lovely evening. Take care. Bye bye.